Pugilufu, Chile. Pugilufu is a Chilean town and commune located in northern Patagonia. Located at the confluence of the Espolón and Futilufu river valleys, the town is approximately 10 kilometers from the Argentinian border. Pugilufu is the provincial capital of Payana province, Los Lagos region. Pugilufu, known locally as Futa, is a frontier town with a growing tourism industry based on adventure tourism, most specifically wildwater rafting, but also fishing, mountain biking, trekking, and canyoning. Due to its proximity to the Argentinian border, Futalufu is most easily accessed from airports in Escal and Boriloche, Argentina. Other tourists access the town through the northern Patagonia airport in Chayton, or via a system of ferries that leave from the closest major Chilean city, Puerto Montt. The town is named after the crystal blue Futalufu River, widely considered to be one of the best whitewater rafting rivers in the world. The name Futalufu derives from a Mapudungan word meaning big river. The town has a population of about 2,000, growing slightly during the summer rafting and kayaking season. The main income for the community is whitewater kayaking and rafting, together with fly fishing and other associated outdoor sports. Many original residents raise sheep, cattle and practice small-scale subsistence farming. A gravel road links the town to Trevelin in Argentina and to the character Austral. It is served by Futalufu Airfield. Following the eruption of Chitain Volcano and the subsequent destruction of Chitain, Futalufu has been the administrative capital of Payana province since March 2009. Climate. Futalufu has an oceanic climate, Köppen climate classification CFB with some drying trend in summer. Winters are cool and wet but mild with a July average of 3.6 Celsius. During this time of the year, precipitation is very high, averaging around 253 to from June to August and humidity is high, averaging around 77-86%. Few days are dry in winter since there are 18-19 days with measurable precipitation from June to August. Snowfalls occur in most years though prolonged snowfall events are uncommon. Summers are dry and mild with a January average of 16.8 Celsius and during this time precipitation is lower, averaging 81.1 mm in February, the driest month. However, precipitation during the summer months are highly variable. In some years, many days can go without a day of precipitation such as the case in 1987 when only 9.9 mm of precipitation was recorded in January while in other years, some monthly precipitation can exceed 300 mm such as in January 1974. Temperatures can occasionally exceed 20 Celsius any time between September and May. The average annual precipitation is 2081.2 mm and there are 169 days with measurable precipitation, although this can vary widely from year to year, ranging from a height of 3536.8 mm in 1971 to a low of only 1159.3 mm in 1998. The record high was 37.0 Celsius in December 1956 and the record low was minus 11.2 Celsius in July 2007. Demographics According to the 2002 census of the National Statistics Institute, Futalif spans an area of 1280 SQKEN and has 1826 inhabitants, 954 men and 872 women. Of these, 1153.63.1% lived in urban areas and 673.36.9% in rural areas. The population grew by 5.2% 91 persons between the 1992 and 2002 censuses. At a border town, many families are of mixed Chilean and Argentinian heritage. Tourism is also changing the demographic composition of Futalufu as young families from Santiago, Argentina, Brazil, Western Europe and North America have immigrated in recent years. Administration As a commune, Futalufu is the third level administrative division of Chile administered by a municipal council and led by an alcalde who is directly elected every four years. Since 2018, the alcalde has been Fernando Grandondonc. Within the electoral divisions of Chile, Fusilufu is represented in the Chamber of Deputies by Gabriel Lucenzo PDC and Alejandro Santana Oren as part of the 58th electoral district together with Castro, Ancud, Quenchai, Dacu, Quiroga de Velas, Quenchai, Pucaldon, Xunchai, Quilain, Colón, Chitain, Hiuleje and Paila. The commune is represented in the Senate by Rabbi Andrew Nat Quinteros Pierce and Yvonne Moreira UDI as part of the 17th Senatorial Constituency Los Lagos region. Landscape and Attractions The Futalufu River is commonly rated by specialised media as one of the best rivers in the world for kayaking and rafting. The river flows in from Argentina through the town and empties into the fjord-shaped Yacho Lake. Day trips and multi-day trips are available in the future while several of its tributaries, such as the Espolón River, Rio Chico and the Azulbli River can be rafted, canoe or navigated by boat. Then Connor Lake, which is fed by aquifers and not glaciers, is best for swimming and water sports. Yeltsha and Espolón lakes are larger, glacially fed, and offer world-class fly fishing. 
Both large lakes feature remote landscapes such as waterfalls, remote bays and old grove forests which are inaccessible by road, so boating and kayaking are highly recommended. Fire fishing is also possible on the Futalufu River, the Rio Chico, the Elcha River, the largest river in the Futalufu Valley and the Spoon River, which is the largest tributary of the Futalufu and contains brine trout and rainbow trout as well as salmon in April and May. Other nearby attractions include the Futalifu National Reserve, known for its population of Humal South and Indo, Kulat National Park and Pumalim Park. Pumalim was once Chile's largest private nature reserve, but has since been absorbed by the national park system and renamed to honour its founder, American environmentalist and founder of the North Face, Douglas Tompkins. Kulat is one of Chile's most dramatic national parks famous for its high glacier and diverse old growth rainforests. Pumalim now renamed Douglas Tompkins Pumalin National Park is a diverse and massive reserve with an extensive infrastructure of trails, campgrounds and visitor centres. La Jolla, an Argentinian ski resort with 2,000 feet of vertical drop and one of the longest ski seasons in South America, is a 70-minute drive from Futalufu. Another attraction across the Argentinian border is Los Alostas National Park, an ESCO protected reserve which features the Futalufu River headwaters and one of the oldest Alostas forests in the world, with trees up to 2,600 years old. Canyoning and rappelling is also possible in the Futalifu Valley with its numerous ravines and waterfalls as well as horse riding and mountain biking.